Well, hello, my friends, and welcome once again to Stately Vaughn Manor and the day we've all been waiting for, the results of the Booktube Spin 2 by Rick McDonald. So yes, Rick McDonald's Booktube Spin number two. Yes, we are, our hearts are all aflutter with anticipation. So you may recall that I uh, did not choose this my li list myself. I asked you, my friends, to choose the list for me. I will link the video down below where I made that request because the books that are on the list, I went from the first comment to comment number 20. And so the first comment to the 20th comment, those are the books on the list. Everything else after that was just extra. And, uh, so I was going to just like read a list, of, but this is too long to read. This will take me like five minutes to read every book that was recommended. So I'm just going to go ahead and go with the spin and I'll tell you who the, who the, what the winner, what the book winner is. And if you're interested in the other books that were recommended, uh, check out the video where I asked, uh, you know, for, for uh, recommendations. And you can look at the comments and uh, see what else was recommended. Now, of course, I've got so many recommendations and so many interesting books that I've decided to actually do a new uh, series of videos. Uh, recommended reads is what I will call it. And uh, once or twice a month, depending on the size of the book, I will do a recommended reads and I will do a video uh, talking about the book. I will tell you who recommended it and it'll be just so fun. But I think it, that's a great idea because it's good to shake it up and uh, read something that you didn't choose yourself because you, you will get introduced to books that you otherwise would never read. Uh, like when Gina Stanier recommended I read uh, that Perot novel by Agatha Christie. Uh, I would not have read that by myself. I never would have picked up an Agatha Christie probably on my own, but Gina Stanier recommended it. So I read it and it was really good. It was a great experience. And I will link that video down below too, if you're curious, uh, because I love to self promote because that's just the kind of guy I am. But anyway, enough preamble. Let's get to the book tube spin itself. Let's see the man spin the wheel. Here's the man. He's getting ready to spin. The excitement. What book will win? Most fun parts of this whole thing. So yeah, if you could comment below, let people comment know below. What read, that we Tell him what you're reading. And, uh, without further ado, without further ado. You're welcome. I feel all right about it, actually. You have the next two months to read this book, so you have May but, and June to read the book, and then... Who takes two months to read a book? But that's, that's nice of him. Uh, thank you, my friend, Mr. McDonald, who I just slammed the case on. So, number one, what was number one on my list? Well, the number one on my list was recommended by one of the greatest booktubers who has ever been on booktube. One of the greatest booktubers who ever will be on booktube. He's in a class by himself. He is the one, the only working man reads. And I will, rec I will link working man reads down below if you're one of the few, one of the few who does not watch working man reads already. This guy is awesome. He's awesome, this guy. So working man reads chose book number one which is Dark Matter by Blake Crouch. So I'm going to be reading Dark Matter by, Gla by Blake Crouch because that is the book that won. Uh, so yeah, 
So I got a couple of books to read before that, but I've got like two months to do it, apparently. So I'm reading The Engineer right now, which uh, is part of Raoul Reads. Raoul Reads. Uh, his book club is reading this one, The Engineer, A Chronicles of Actian Story by Darren M. Hanshaw. So I'm reading this and I'm not very far into it. So it's gonna take me another week, probably. Then I'm going to be doing the first in my vintage science fiction series, which is going to be Time Out of Joint by Philip K. Dick. And then, and then I will get to Dark Matter by Blake Crouch. So fantastic. Thank you, my friend, Working Man Reads. Thanks to everybody who gave me uh, these great book recommendations. I got a lot of recommendations from a lot of people. Uh, yeah, even my mom recommended a book on here. Thanks, mom. I'm going to read that book anyway. Timeline uh, by Michael Crichton. Of course, I'm going to read that book. Uh, yeah, and I'm going to read a lot of these books uh, in the in the nearish future. So watch for those videos. And thank you for joining me for the results of the BookTube spin here at Stately Vaughn Manor. It might be a day or two before my next video. Uh, so look out for that. The next video I'm going to be doing is going to be doing, is going to be this one, uh, A Review of Wool by Hugh Howie. And this book was ac actually recommended that I push this up on my TBR uh, by um, Book Blather. Uh, Olive at Book Blather, I'm pretty sure. It, it, sh it was Olive, I think, who told me to uh, push this up. So yes, my next video uh, probably uh, is going to be, uh, I don't know, Saturday, Friday or Saturday. One of those weekendy type days, I'll be doing that. So look for that. And thank you, my friends. Thank you for joining me here at Stately Vaughn Manor. Bye, guys.